All right, what are we calling this segment? Gun show two. No. Badass fucking triceps. Badass, um, it's biceps too, but. All right, here we go, hit it. Hey guys, Dr. Eric here. Uh, trainer Jeff is holding the phone for me and being a good guy. Um, so basically this is a uh, part two of the gun show, badass biceps and triceps. We're gonna do some more in the future, a lot of cool videos, but here's a nice little uh, mini set, especially if you're short on time. Um, sometimes what I like to do is, is more of a circuit move, especially if you're tight on, and crunched on time, going biceps and triceps back to back, really getting that blood flow cooking, really getting that metabolic pump. So what I like to do, you could do anything you want. You can do close grip, close grip bench presses or you can do dips as your tricep. And a great way to, to really stimulate bicep growth is chin-ups. You can do a lot more weight with chin-ups than you can with curls because it's a compound movement. So you're getting more muscles involved, so you could throw on a hell of a lot more weight and really stimulate hypertrophy, especially as your first set. You know, you want to focus on some strength first and then move on to some isolation work. That's a great way to do it. So bang out some dips and then you go to chins and you go back and forth. Two methods here. One, you could do four sets of say 20 to 25 reps each. So you're banging out, you know, 25 reps of these, you know, doing one, you know, two, crank out 25, go over here, do some chins. You can alternate and grip narrow and wide. And do 25 of these. If you're really going to be crazy, you could hold a knee up to really work those abs at the same time. So 25, 25, go back and forth. That's one version. Version two this is another cool version I picked up uh, from another gentleman uh, right now, but I name escapes me. But here's a cool one. Set the time for about uh, six, seven, eight minutes. I'd say say six minutes, okay? Come over here, pick a weight. Ideally, you can do, it's gonna be a little weighted. You might want to start with body weight, but eventually you can grab a barbell or a kettlebell, hold it, so it's a weighted dip. Whatever you, can, you think you can do, about eight to 10 reps. What you're gonna do is you're gonna come over here and you're gonna bang out three reps, right? So say I'm holding a kettlebell or a barbell, I'm just using my weight, three reps. Come over here, grab the chins. Again, start with body weight, but if you wanna hold a barbell between your legs to make it a weighted chin, maybe something that you could do for eight to 10 reps, and then you're bang out three of these, right? So three, one, two, three. Back, repeat. Just go back and forth, guys. Three reps, three reps, three reps, three reps. Hell of a lot harder for you to do them weighted, but start with body weight. Or maybe start with the movement. But be careful with the, with the dips. You wanna make sure your shoulder is back and down. It's hard to hear, but if you have both one on a barbell, it's easy to pike your, pike your body a little bit. And do not go past parallel, it's gonna kill your shoulders. Don't go past parallel. Like I said, keep your body upright, straight, shoulders back and down, help save your shoulders. So try that. So